All right, here's the deal. I started a fresh, brand new NBA 2K22 My Team account, and I plan on playing on this account for 12 hours to see the team that I can make. I'm gonna be playing games, I'm gonna be sniping. If you guys do end up enjoying the vid, then click that like button. It helps me out a ton. Thanks. The first thing I did when I opened all my starter packs is I went to see if I had any desirable things just because I want to unlock the auction house straight away. Also, what I did is the two locker codes that were available, we typed those in as well to unlock the auction house. And then we listed all those desirable things such as badges, contracts, just to get as much MT as possible to make my starter team. Yeah, I have 3000 MT. I already have this team. Now this triple threat team, it's, it's really, really good. Literally all I've been doing is just buying pink diamonds with contracts or roughly about 2000 to 2200 and then once the contracts are up reselling them for a profit because i'm sniping them like this micro car williams i got for 850 this is the new tto lineup we're running with like, literally all these cards we snipe for about 2000 mt i'm hoping to make a little bit of profit on donovan once he sells but in terms of the progress we have those three and we still have these two cards waiting to sell as well in terms of our board progress we're five and one now the ascension has been very very kind to me we have a deluxe pack a supernova pack another deluxe pack a diamond consumables pack and a fan favorites pack so we could potentially get some nice money makers here very false heat check another heat check can they give me like Giannis or anything all right diamond consumable you know what that's not that bad all right fan favorites award pack and then we'll do the yep proper fan favorite that all right supernova deluxe come on 2k make it nice oh we got a shake <laughs> but use my little progress these two players have sold oh, all three of my players are now out of their contracts so we're gonna go sell them and then rinse and repeat again all right this wasn't a bad refresh i promise this isn't gonna turn into a sniping video so that was a f lie but there's a few cards we got we got this lamarcus aldridge for 2k we got this limited edition mj who remember was this card when it came out i think i gave away this card at one point we got this this Shaq and this Magic Johnson, that Shaq actually sold for 5k, believe it or not. Then we just got these two cards. We're probably going to sell them on to try and maybe get an Opal. All right, update for our three. This is the current team we have for TTO. Still rocking pink diamonds just because I'm 11 and 1. Like, why change it? It's just going really well. We have two cards waiting to sell. And we have a few of these cards to redeem. So overall, once these cards sell, we'll be over about 26,000 MT alongside a team that's about 6k. So we're getting close to buying a dark matter already, which is kind of nuts. All right, we're on the end of hour four. I think currently have 2000 MT. We have all this to redeem. I also have made some lineup uh, adjustments. We actually have some players in the lineup. Here is literally dynamic duos. Denny I got for 1500. Kevin I got for 2.5 I think. Cameron I sniped for 1.2 and Rui I bought for 3k. Bad that I paid the most for a Rui card, but in terms of a TTO team, I literally just said to, yeah, it's, oh, that's all I've been playing with is this. Oh yeah, RJ Barrett. <laughs> I forgot I sniped him for a thousand. So in terms of these cards we saw here, the Magic and T-Mac did sell. We got this Steph Curry for 2,000. It's the dynamic ratings one, so not too bad that this pink diamond filter has been so freaking amazing. Our, I think, five update. So in terms of the team, I completed Triple Threat Online, so I'm not playing Triple Threat Online much now. I'm playing Triple Threat to get Bob McAdoo. And and because it's literally we're at the start of TT, it's literally rookie difficulty. In terms of the MT front, we still have three cards to sell, and we have seven that are sold. This Billy Cunningham, we sniped for 2,000 MT, and he sold for 7K, which is freaking ridiculous just amazing all right hour six or seven done I, i've lost track at this point in terms of stuff we sold we sold a few of the ones these shacks we bought for 2000 mt we actually sniped a few of these cards for 500 mt which is kind of nuts triple threat is very boring you're joking if you guys are curious what player i'm using i'm using trey burke because trey burke's actually all right on rookie difficulty now this shocks me this is where it is actually picked up you can see my mt is down i have some players selling i have some players to redeem so we can now redeem these so in terms of this shoe i pulled a diamond shoe pack i chuck random boosts on it and it's sold for 5.8k within about two minutes so it's free real estate in terms of where we're looking at with the team we have two new dark matters you can probably figure out which who one of them is and the other one is a bit of a surprise so a surprise is paul pierce he has a diamond contract dark matters at the moment are about 32k and he popped up for 33k with a diamond contract you know just saving me empty in the long run we also got bob mcadoo and i didn't have to do all the 30 tt games to get him i only had to do 19. But in terms of the team now i'm not really too sure where to take this team like nine hours it could be better but you know what they could certainly be worse right, 
lads, we are officially done. We have about 20,000 MT left in the bank, and this is our full team. Obviously, it's not the greatest team in the world, but it's definitely a team I could be comp with. Stop the cap. <laughs> If you guys want to see another 12 hours where I do a 24 hour video, then let me know because it could be a lot of fun. If you guys want to see this pink diamond filter in more action, click above my head. Take the layer, take care. Peace.